Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix EAFC25 game crashing when entering squad battles. So, if you're interested, let's start this tutorial. In this case, if you're having problems with your game here, there are a few things that you can do here to probably solve this issue. So first things first, which is the most obvious thing here, is you need to ensure that you have the latest version of the game. In this case, if you're using Steam, go ahead and open up Steam here and make sure that you've installed the latest update. Now also, what you need to do here is you also want to ensure that you have the latest driver for your, in this case, your graphics, graphics card. In this case, you want to go ahead and open up your graphics driver here. And usually, like for example, if you're using NVIDIA, you need to open up GeForce here, Experience, or again, if you're using AMD or any other, uh, in this case, uh, GPU out there, go ahead and install the uh, latest driver. But in this case, uh, since I'm using NVIDIA here, you want to go to the driver section here and just basically download the uh, available updates. So you can go ahead and click on check for updates here. And if you do see one, just click on the download button here and wait for it to complete. Now once it's actually, or once it's actually completed, you go ahead and open up FC25 here and see if that solves the issue. Also, another thing that you could do here is to make sure that your power is actually, or in this case, the performance of your PC is actually uh, pretty good. So in this case, what you need to do is you need to go to your battery first. So at the bottom left, you want to go to power. From here, you want to click on the edit power plan option here. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to change a few things here. So in this case, let's go ahead and choose change advanced power settings here. And all we need to do is we need to go to power options here. Yeah, yeah. So go to power options here. And what you need to do is you need to change this to balance. So in this case, if you have this in power saver mode, it will actually cut down on the performance itself. It's going to save power, especially if you're using your laptop. But in this case, I recommend you to use the balance power here and basically uh, start using it in this mode here. Now, another thing that you could do here is to make sure that your, in this case, your settings here are actually uh, pretty good. So in this case, I would like, I would like, I, what I like doing here is I want to tweak my performance here. So usually I'll have the option to adjust the preference and performance of windows here. And you have a bunch of options here. So you have the let windows choose what's best for my computer. But if you want to maximize the performance of your PC, you could change this to adjust for best performance. Now this will actually disable some of the options here, but you could customize this further. So the more you disable here, the more uh, allocated power or performance that you may use for your game here. But then again, just choose either best performance here for, or in this case, best performance here, and just click on apply and okay. And basically that will improve the performance of your PC. Now from then on, see if that solves the issue. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.